but most of them just go flying through here like it's the Indy 500. <laughs> Nancy Eastman's trip to the mailbox can be a daily danger. It's kind of scary to even go to your mailbox. Sometimes you have to look both ways and make sure there's not anyone coming. Central Grove Road is a shortcut between Highway 45 and Highway 278. As with most county roads, the speed limit is 55. Some areas are reduced. It is reduced here at the curve, but Eastman says that really doesn't slow them down. Supervisor Carol Crawford would like to see the speed lowered in some areas, but that requires state approval. It takes several steps to be able to get this done. So I want the public to know that we're working on it, we're concerned about it, we're concerned about the fact that they're concerned about the speed. A speed monitor similar to this one is being moved to areas where speeding is a problem. County officials keep receiving calls from those areas. The complaint is a familiar one. They're flying by the house. I'm scared they're going to run over my kid, my grandkid, my dog. We're hoping that that will bring people uh, to mind that that safety factor of uh, when you're speeding, you're going to hurt somebody. Back at Nancy Eastman's house, she hopes the speed monitor will slow drivers down. I think it's great if they will heed and notice how fast they're going and slow down. In Monroe County, I'm Susan Parker for WTVA News.